Hello everybody and welcome back to the CK2 Succession series in Holy Fury. It's been a little while, but we are back. Let's see what the heck is going on. What has Lambert left me? We are Emperor Count Lambress Sharp Teeth. Okay, interesting name. Uh, we are married to a duke no less. Oh, and we're his heir. We could murder him. That seems, that seems good. Uh, how, is he good as a, a, a husband? He's strong, which is not bad. Quite a few people want to help us kill him. We're currently in hiding. Why is this? Someone trying to kill me by chance? <clears throat> I don't know of anyone trying to kill me. Well, we will come out of hiding then. Ooh, choose military aspect. Cool, because we are... We are already the heroine of the Silver Arrowheads. In fact, we've almost completed a legend. Hell yes. What is our personal combat skill? 152. Good good. Goodness gracious me. All right, why can't I come out of hiding? We could build an observatory. We have a... Uh, we are on scholarship focus. Sure, we'll build an observatory. Why not? Uh, there are warriors of Peron. We have a holy order, looks like. The, the, knight, the knights of Anglesey. Almost Ainsley. <laughs> All right. Where? Oh, we've got a bunch of men. Who are we at war with? Just a little... Little count. Okay. And we've got this glorious du jour empire, and we've got some drift into our du jour empire. Fantastic. What are we going to try and accomplish? I have no idea. We need an ambition, first off. We want to become a paragon of virtue, sure. I mean, really, the priority should be trying to get this legend, right? We need to go and uh, go on a, whatever it's called, a quest. I've never actually had one of those. We had a sun. Hello, welcome to the world. No, Aggie. Aggie's good. I believe my first character was called Aggie, so that seems only appropriate. We'll name him here. That. We've got a defensive pact against us. Very small. Cool. What's my threat? Must be low, right? 96%. Okay, and yet we still have a very small defensive pact against us. Uh, we have eight out of three holdings. Where have I got holdings? Up here. Why the heck do I have holdings up here? Why is this my crown focus? Oh, I bet uh, I bet the person that inherited already owned this land. That would make a lot of sense. Okay. Um, congratulations, local bishop. You can get this title. Can't because you only have 25 vassal theocracies. Fair enough. In that case, give me a noble... Congratulations. Oh, yes, and I think we're on... Uh, I'll look into this in just a second, but... I'm pretty sure we are... Oh, I don't have the duchy. That's bizarre. I'm pretty sure we have the pagan reform, which means we... Uh, 51% currently control 50. What? Oh, this one here, okay. Uh, I'm pretty sure we have the pagan reform, which means we have to be female rulers. So that'd be fun. It'd be different. There's a Celestia for you. We still got one over the limit. There are only five. Oh no, there are six in this area. Okay. Well, yeah, we'll definitely need a new husband then. So you, my good man, are going to be murdered. Uh, we will see what we can do to get 200% plot power. Doesn't look like it's going to be possible, so that's okay. Uh, we have some factions. Quite a few people want more faction power. Good lord, a lot of people hate us. Why do you hate us so much, my queen? Opinion predecessor minus 103. Lambert, what did you do? Oh my god. That is outrageous. What kind of council power we got? <clears throat> uh, we definitely don't want full. I never banish people. Sure, here. Have banishment. And that will hopefully appease some of the council power types. And you want independence as well. You're du jour, my freaking empire. And you want independence. Lambert, what have you done? Well, we might be able to excommunicate him. Hmm, doesn't look like it. Not yet. We're not even the head of our freaking religion. What did you do, Rose? Why would you... Why? <laughs> Minus 80. Lambert. Lambert, what did you do? Okay, we need uh, some chancellors. Marshall, can't unappoint you because you're currently voting on a law change. What kind of law change are we implementing? Um, you... I will try and suck up to this queen, get her on the council. 
And the rest of them are voting on law change. Was law? Oh, right, yeah, rule of banishment. Well, that's fine. They will, uh, they'll definitely vote for that. Who could have taken him seriously? That sounds beneath me to me. All right, they've approved it. Uh, and if these guys fire again, it's not the worst thing in the world. Uh, now, it's their, their strength is rapidly diminishing. Okay, so everyone gather up and uh, crush these guys. They flagged raiders. We don't need that. Just want to actually get this war done. What kind of war is this? It's a uh, war to depose this guy. Why the heck are we in a war to depose him? Oh well, we'll go along with it. Easy win, of course. There we go. Boom. Get deposed. We get some piety. Oh, that's probably why. He was trying to crank piety so he could form a new empire. I don't know why. I can't remember why he wanted to form a new empire. I think he thought the map color was ugly or something. I don't know. I, I'm, I'm, I don't dislike it. I think we're going to keep it. What? The chief just was sacrificed to someone's gods. Outrageous. Get out of here. Another one of my courtiers sacrificed. And, yeah, sure. Sacrifice to the divine. Sounds good. You guys are all my retinues. Yeah. Well, you can come on home then. <clears throat> A couple of vassal levy still raised. Okay, and crown focus in uh, the capital. We do not have any prosperity in my capital province. Oh, we have a tiny bit here. But still, that's outrageous. Let's start uh, holding fairs and things to try and raise the prosperity. How are we doing artifact-wise? We've got, uh, still got the Knife of the Mountains, I'm glad to see. Not the one we're currently using, but still. Best crown. <laughs> okay. Um, looks like we could do with... Oh, no, we got best armor. Oh, it's not actually best because it's three out of five, but oh well. Uh, other decisions we could do? Get Lodge Commander. Uh, yeah, that's fine. Alright, we just need to try and crank this legend. I think it's only missions that do that. I don't think, like, just us dueling would accomplish it. Do we have any rivals? We do not. Let's take a look at why our vassals hate us. It's just all a pre opinion of predecessor and domain problems, I think. Looks like it. And you desire a kingdom. I hold a kingdom in Flanders. Yeah, well, that's getting given away. Uh, you seem powerful and old. Currently inviting her to plot. And we'll make her even more chuffed about us by giving her this kingdom. We are an empire, so it's not going to give her independence or anything. Traitors have risen up. Where? Here? How organized is our realm? Oh, look at that. Nice internal borders. Good game, previous players. I, uh do very much like it when we can have clean internal borders. Alright, you guys let's just go trounce this lot. Hey, a special tithe. Excellent. It looks like there hasn't been a great amount of investment made into Sicily, so I'm going to change that and uh, do my best to pour wealth into Sicily. Oh, some of these are upgrading so they at least were doing some. Good. Yeah, keep cranking all this up. Good. There's the fair completed. Uh, what else could we do? Yeah, it's, about, it's about that for now. I don't think we need a smith. Random prisoner becoming an heir to somewhere. Right, aren't we a blood sacrificing type? Uh, here, I can see it from here. Oops, there we go. Um, we can excommunicate, can grant divorces, and so we can grant claims. Forbids men to own temple holdings. No opinion penalty for female rulers and heirs. You can't be at peace for too long. Men are excluded from all positions of power. And we can sacrifice infidels. Okay. So. You lot. Let's do some sacrificing, shall we? I thought Lambert had a problem with, uh, with piety and prestige. I mean, this seems like a pretty good way to get a lot of piety and prestige. I wonder if there's a reason to not do this. <laughs> I'm gonna do it either way, really. This isn't giving me like a stacking penalty with anyone, is it? Doesn't look like it. Cool. I wish there was a sacrifice all. I think there is a button for that actually, or a, a, a mod. Obviously you can't use that in this uh, campaign, but I should use that in my next CK2 campaign. There's one called like Court Manager. It's a, like a ransom all without the pop-ups and a, uh, I bet it has a sacrifice all as well. Why can't I sacrifice you? 
Because you're not of my, you are not of a uh, heathen religion. Can we sacrifice you anyway? Blood for the blood gods, always being good. Oh, good. I can pop up multiple at once, so I don't need to click through them one at a time. That's handy. Well, we need to go to war with more foreigners so that we can uh, sacrifice them all to our gods. There we go. 800 piety already. It needs to be done. We might uh, we might no longer be kind. <laughs> That's good. Feudal vassals and city vassals don't like this. What? But our church vassals like it. Opposite vassal opinion plus five. That's interesting. It's come to attention that your son remains outside our fold. Talk him into being a member of the Silver Arrowheads. Of course. He is a child, though. So I literally cannot do this. I don't think. My son, why are you over there? He's with his... Ah, he's with his father. Well, that's alright. Your father is not long for this world. No, they, they've, they've turned against my desire to kill him. Ah, it's probably because he's in seclusion. But that's not working. Fair enough. Uh, right. Steward, you suck. Let's get a new steward. Spymaster, you also suck. New spymaster. Uh, you like me. Uh, you're plenty good. I don't really need to rock the boat on that. Whoa, my aunt is a goddess. Fantastic. We will take... Uh, maybe economy tax? Economy advancing in our capital? Not right now, so we'll just go with taxes. Oh, actually, I should have stayed on the minister realm. Really? But that's okay. So, search vassals for not my religion group and landed. And then let's kill them. Hello. A bunch of people. Really? Well, I need, uh, I'm only interested in direct vassals. You are my vassal, but he's uh, several layers down, sort of by rank. There's a prince mayor, a king here of the wrong religion. Outrageous. Since he's an infidel, only such and such will object. And he will say no. All the better. It will cause a, uh, a revolt, which is going to be very handy for us. Because <clears throat> stamping down a major revolt is uh, a wonderful and prestigious thing to do. Alright, you guys. Marshal here. Only a thousand men from that whole northern reach. Wow. So has, has, uh, has this area recovered? I remember I, I burnt it all down. <laughs> Not fully. <laughs> but it looks like we made some conquests without burning everything down to the very ground, which I must say I do not approve of. All right. Uh, we could also do some blood games. Stand together. I have, How much renown do I have? I have plenty of renown. Sure. Stand together. A 96 men non-reinforcing group. Yeah, I don't believe you. No, it's thousands. <laughs> that sounds far more plausible a number. All right, let's get in there. Good. Where's the capital of this revolt? Down here. Okay, well, we will uh, just head straight down there, I think. Get them sieged out. Uh, laws we could change. Nothing else I really want to change right now. Trying to recruit our child. Does he love me back? He's been working relentlessly to aid us in the war. I'm not, I can't be distracted right now. Uh, I don't mind being proud. Pride gives prestige. Is there something strange out there? Let's find the Necronomicon. Sounds fun. Okay, got a... Oh, and a peasant revolt. Have we got much revolt risk around? <laughs> yeah, quite a bit. Okay. This is a uh, an unstable realm I've been handed. I don't really have any expansionist desires right now. So I think we'll just, uh, we'll just stabilize and uh, try and get this legend done. You know, see how it goes. If you guys want to gather up here, be grand. Oh, I'm pregnant. My husband is still in freaking seclusion. There's probably a plague somewhere up here. Yeah, there is. Fair enough, then. Can't really hold it against him. I can throw someone in jail. What have you been doing? She's plotting to fabricate a claim. She, rather. But that's okay. We are... We are on the case. All right, any other vassals annoyed for a good reason? Yes, you. You are incapable, however, because you are suffering from a bedridden case of dysentery, so I don't think you're gonna be a concern for very much longer, if I'm being honest. If you guys wanna come down here as well. But you can just grab that one. Be enemies till the end. Oh, I do have a rival. I thought I didn't have a rival. Good man, I'd love to duel you. 
I can't, however, because, uh... Excuse me? Character special interest. There we go. Uh, because we are, of course, in a war. Once we finish this revolt, our, we will duel, and our duel will be legendary. Alright, good. We are losing money at quite a rate. Might have to stand down some of our uh, personal levies soon, but that's okay. Of course, we will personally lead combat. Uh, it looks like we're going to have highly unbalanced flanks. So, you know what? We need, have no need for flanks. Count Lambes <laughs> will gloriously lead the full force in the center and charge into Genoa. Smash them. Do we still count as flanked when we've uh, taken out two of them? I think we do. Yeah, still do we get the flanking debuff. But we smashed them. There is a star that disappears when I look directly at it. At it. We will... Should we sacrifice her? Yeah, go on then. I was thinking maybe we don't sacrifice her. What a bother. The number of good dresses I'm still able to wear is increasingly small. Uh, I'll order new clothes. Sure. Sounds good. The immortals must be appeased. I am now a hemophont. I did lose kind. But there we go. Look at that. This woman is renowned as a bloodthirsty fanatic. Glorious. Sounds good to me. Let's keep chasing down this army. And we get there ahead of them. Looks like I'm an organizer or something. Nice, I am an organizer. Superb. High Chief of Toulouse. Sacrifice her. Sacrifice her. Her reputation is ruined, except it isn't. Because that still works, and he has no idea. We have a regent. Why? Ah, oh, I'm in the final months of my pregnancy. Fair enough. There you guys. Get them. Bring them down. Uh, another sacrifice for the divine. Sounds good. Superb. Superb. Bon. And we had a daughter, finally. Which, it now occurs to me, we had three sons, which was actually pretty terrible. She will focus on struggle. She's already a strong gal. We actually captured the leader of the revolt. Well, we will not kill him, but we will kill all of his compatriots that we captured along with him. And we will enforce demands. Welcome to my prison. Uh, welcome to being sacrificed. Uh, your son, your son and heir, I will, uh, I will do you the ultimate injustice. I'm going to sway, would you like a painting? Yeah. I'm going to sway your son to my religion. Wait for it. Excuse me, I can't demand his conversion. I really wish I hadn't given him that painting now. Why can't I demand his conversion? We're a reformed pagan. He's in my realm. Maybe he needs to be my vassal. Weird. All right, so, now, characters. People who are not my religion, who are my vassals. Congratulations, you get your titles revoked. And you get your titles revoked. I can't do it anymore because has had has titles that can be revoked. I can't revoke your title because what? Your, it's a republic? I can't revoke it just because it's a republic? Well, then we can at least sacrifice you to the almighty creators for a whole bunch of prestige. And this guy still likes me. He's a little peeved. Because I'm a heretic and uh, he's the wrong government type. Can I demand conversion now? Yes. But we must be at peace to do that. Or we'll special interest him. I bet we can get him to convert. Because I'd like him to uh, still be powerful over there. That seems good. Now, Duke of Barcelona. Uh, no titles for you, good sir. You are not allowed to live in my lands with these darn heretics. Anyone else? I think these guys are all vassals under vassals. God, what a disorganized realm. You gotta keep them all revoked. You gotta keep them all in line. Can't have this religious disunity nonsense. We will, uh, we will fix it, is what we will do. We will fix it. Okay, we got rid of his title. Others? Doesn't look like it. Is there a faster way to do this? Like, to see who's the one directly beneath me? I don't know that there is. I suppose what I could try and do is just go to my vassals list and then say, okay, who has the heretic opinion penalty? Yeah, that's a good way of doing it. 
There we go. You, for example, what we know about you. Uh, anywhere else? It doesn't look like I'm seeing many other people. He's um, She's ambitious. Duchy of Navarra. Which is de facto over here for some reason. <laughs> okay. You want... Uh, you want the de jure kingdom, this kingdom here. Well, you know what? My gal, you are the good religion. You've got your husband locked up. It's the kind of thing we approve of in this, uh, whatever it's called. Ag Agnatic clans thing. You can have the kingdom. Enjoy it. And now she loves me, even though she's not on the council. Suddenly, you're not such a big, powerful person anymore. Now that the balance of power has shifted. So she can come and be my uh, my troop training gal, and you can go back onto the council, onto just working on prosperity. Good. If you guys want to stand down, we're at war with someone. Who are you? Peasant revolt. It's a titchy little peasant revolt. You guys go and deal with them. In fact, we'll just have the retinues go and deal with them. You guys all retinues? Oh, that's right. No, some of you are the the warriors we raised up. who are going to stick around until we actually win the war. Now, we have some land. Uh, Milady, you are welcome to Barcelona. Now we're at seven. Where's the last one? Is that it? No. What's the other one I have? Oh, yes, Foi, <clears throat> which is in which kingdom? Same one, so we'll just give it to her. She can give it out, or she can keep it herself. You know, she might want to consolidate some power. I like having, uh, you know, good, powerful vassals, so... That works out fine. Now, vassals. Starting from the bottom. Anyone think I'm a heretic? Do, 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 do. There's one. You, my good sir, good man. First off, why are you my vassal? You probably desire control of a bunch of these? Yeah. You desire control first of the Duchy of Barcelona, which I hold personally. Yep, here you go. You wanted another thing, I think. But that was one of the lower down ones. Good. All right, that's dealt with him. All right, other vassals that are peeved. You. You could be... What are you good at? Not much. All right, well... Stewardship isn't that important, although I do want the prosperity, so you can be my steward. And you can uh, have a large gift as well. All right, vassals happy, pretty much. Yeah, looking pretty good. Uh, of course, I must move forward on my studying of the skies. Factions more or less dealt with. Good. Well, that was a good first episode. Thoroughly stabilized the land. And uh, just a mild financial problem now. What is that coming from? Just big retinue expense. We'll stop reinforcing the retinue for a second. That's fine. Okay. Well, thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. Hit the like button if you did. It helps out a great deal. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.